Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be a super fun and super easy nail tutorial and it's going to be for this awesome Argyle print nail which by the way how cute is my ring it's so sparkly with the lights um, but this is the nail tutorial like I said it's super easy to do and I love this print especially for this time of year that's definitely mo like mainly seen on sweaters and knee-high socks and kind of like warmer clothing options I guess you would say so I'll insert a photo right now just in case you're not familiar with Argyle print yeah, so I definitely associate this pattern with like this time of year, like fall and winter and sweaters and socks and stuff like that. So that's why I wanted to do this. I think it's also a really good back to school design. I didn't do any back to school nail tutorials, but I think this would have been a good one. I should have uploaded this like a couple weeks ago. You know, go, if you're in school, this is obviously super cute. If you're not in school, it doesn't matter. This is just a really cute and fun, easy manicure. And I hope that you guys try it out. So I'm going to get right into the tutorial and then I will see you guys afterwards. Okay, so you're going to start by painting your nail two colors, and there's no real trick to that. You just kind of stop in the middle and then go on with a different color. Silver color is China Glaze, Cheers to You, and the pink color is Oralee's Fancy Fuchsia. You're just going to take some regular scotch tape like this. You're going to get two pieces. When you peel the tape off of the dispenser, you get these like jaggedy lines, so you're going to want to make sure to take a pair of scissors and cut that off. It looks like that. So you're just going to take your first piece of tape and place it onto your nail right where the two colors meet up at a diagonal. And you're going to do the same with the second piece of tape. Now I'm just using OPI's Black Onyx and I'm going to paint side triangles. I'm going to let it dry for less than a minute and we're going to peel the tape off. Mistakes do happen, so see how I got a little bit of black in the pink section? I'm just going to go back in with my pink nail polish and just cover that up. Once the black has completely dried, we're just going to be taking a white nail striper like this. It's going to draw a V starting at the cuticle. And you want to make sure to bring the edge of the V not into the middle of the black triangle, but actually up towards the top. Just going to crisscross that design. And again, we're not bringing the top of this stripe to the center of our nail. We're actually just kind of overlapping it a little, a little bit. pretty much the finished design. I'm just going to smooth it all out with a fast drying top coat. Okay, so here is the finished Argyle print manicure. I think it's so pretty, so easy to do as you guys saw, and it's really I don't know, it just reminds me of like back to school, fall time. Something about this manicure that I really, really love. It's just so like preppy and cute and classic. And I hope that you do try out this really fun Argyle print manicure. Okay, so I hope that you guys like this nail tutorial. Or that you can make this manicure completely your own just by using whatever colors that you want. And if you do try this out, I would love to see your versions. You can send me photos on Twitter or Facebook. They're both at Mischief Fabulous, so I will link them both down below. Please send me your photos if you do try this out. I love seeing your photos and retweeting them so everyone else can see them. It's so much fun. So. And like always, I will have photos on my nail polish and beauty blog, polishandpearls.com. So I will put that link down below if you want to check out my blog. And I think that is pretty much it. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this fun, easy Argyle print manicure. I hope that you try it out, and I will talk to you guys soon.